So to run it, I'm going to put a breakpoint here just so we can step through. Actually, I'll put a breakpoint even higher so that actually let me put a breakpoint even up here. Let me put a breakpoint in test base, initialize and then control tab to go back. And then I can click here and do debug using ReSharper. For those of you without ReSharper, you right click and then you do debug tests. It's going to be the same thing. OK, I'm just going to do with ReSharper because it's way easier. That's why I like it. That's why a lot of people like it. So it starts running the tests. And that passed. Durr. You guys remember when I was speaking about making mistakes? Well, I just made one and we created this web driver instance that doesn't really get used anywhere. So we can't run our test right now to show you what it does, but that's okay because we can compare them just to look at them and then we will move on because we need a few more steps before we proceed to running of the tests. And just remember, I made a mistake and everything was okay. Nobody died and I know what I'm doing. So you guys will also make mistakes. Just don't be scared. Go back a few steps, try to figure out where you went wrong and then continue from there. So let's compare this guy to a uh, new vertical tab group. And let me compare it to this one, right? Three to four. Let me pin this over here and pin the properties just to make it a little bit bigger. Pin the test explorer. Now check it out, guys. So now we're inheriting from a test base. We've removed this part from our test over here on the left, which is the new test. And now we even removed the go to method. And we, this is basically the same if we were to run the test. That's why we commented this out so that we can run it, but we can't run it. So either way, this remains. So if we were able to run it now, we would be able to execute this test and it would go to the page, then it would log in and then it would do this and this. OK, but you guys see how we removed this dependency from this class and now it lives in test base and we also removed the go to method that now lives in the test base as well. How awesome is that?